Hey Phil, uh, here's a quick video for you. Um, there's a power supply 14 volts connected to uh, my speed Arduino. I've got what they call a Druid, an Arduino Druid or Druid for Arduino, which is basically a, a little signal injection uh, going into the Arduino. The, the Arduino Mega is at the bottom there and obviously the speed Arduino connected. And I've just got uh, three pots, 10K pots over there, which I'm using for uh, intake air temperature, coolant temperature and throttle position um, obviously feeding into the, the correct uh, uh, pins on the, the IDC40 connector I've got a few extras that are lying around here which aren't connected at the moment for boost and everything you can see a boost control solenoid so I've been playing around with it just to to test and everything seems to work fine uh, the, the green LEDs are the injection LEDs and the red LEDs are ignition um, and obviously this little guy here um, has got a piece of software called Druid, Druid for Arduino and it basically allows you to inject a signal uh, which I'm going to basically do here. So it's got, a, it's got various uh, uh, wheels and things like that. So if you go to wheel options, list the wheels, um, it will basically list all of the wheels over there. So I choose wheel number four. Um, if I go up here, whoops, wheel four is a 60 minus two, oops, I mean all the way down to the bottom again. Wheel four is a 60 minus two crank only, and then five is a 60 minus two with crank and cam. So what I'll do is I'm actually going to go and say choose a wheel, and then I'm going to type in five and enter. And now it's basically injecting uh, um, the signal into the speed wiener, as you can see by the LEDs. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up Tuna Studio and I'm going to go and open up my March firmware and once it connects you'll basically see okay, it's obviously injecting at 6000 RPM at the moment um, that's obviously why those LEDs are flashing so fast but if you have a look at the, the manifold pressure um, that's 116 kPa um, absolute and then we've got air temp we've got our coolant temp and throttle position now obviously if I go and uh, play around with the, uh, the potentiometers obviously I'm going to get different readings there now the way Tuna Studio works, I'm just getting this Druid for Arduino back up here. I'm going to go over there, back to top, and I'm going to say set a swept RPM, and I'm going to go and say from 850 RPM to 6,500 RPM at 1,500 RPM per second. When I press enter, that's what basically happens. Now, how this is working is the Druid for Arduino, that software interfaces into this little uh, Arduino Uno and obviously the Arduino Uno output which is on pin 13, uh, sorry pin 9, goes into the uh, the crank input which is pin 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, pin 25 on the IDC connector. Now I tried to load your program onto the same Arduino and uh, I sent you videos and uh, screenshots of the scope and everything uh, showing you how that works. But basically this is how 90% uh, of the guys are using uh, Tuna Studio in conjunction with the Speed Reno um, to test or bench test uh, um, the actual unit. You can actually see there depending on how you've connected your uh, um, ignition up you will either have it in batch mode or sequential or semi-sequential that will basically ignite either or light up all four LEDs or only two. Um, but yeah, that's that's just an intro as to how I connect everything up. Uh, let me know if I can help you out with anything else. Let me know if that uh, basically gave you all the info that you need. If there's anything else, just shout. I'll, I'll help you where I can.